I'll tap on the balloon thumbnail to select the text layer. When we tap on animation, you have three different animation settings, in, overall, and out. In refers to what happens when the text first appears on the screen. Overall refers to what happens while the text is visible on the screen. And out, you guessed it, refers to when the text disappears off the screen at the end of the clip. We'll start with in. I'll tap on in, and you have many different animation options. These first ones are free and can be used with any subscription. However, the last few, in order to use these, you need to have a paid subscription. You can try them out without a paid subscription, but when you go to export your clip, you'll be prompted to pay for the upgrade at that time in order to export your video. To choose an animation, tap on it. I like scale. You can increase or decrease the length of time the animation takes to come in or out using this slider. I'll leave it like it is and go back to the, the animation options one more time. And I'm going to tap on out. I'm going to choose the same animation. You'll notice that there's a pink box around the text layer. If I tap on the screen to unselect it, that pink box will disappear. Let's take a look at our title card without the text layer selected. This looks great. The next step is to export the title card. So I'll tap on export. I'll choose my resolution and FPS settings, and then I'll save it to my photo roll by tapping on save. 